so you happen to be ghost hunting down at Cooch's Bridge and you get a late night craving for some pizza, what better place to go than Grotto's Pizza on Main Street in Newark, Delaware? So here we got the specialty pizzas. We got the Meat Lovers, the Grand Fiesta, um, but some that are looking interesting to us are the Buffalo Chicken and the Philly Cheese Steak. Now, what are your thoughts on these two pizzas? I think they both sound really good. Um, of course, the buffalo chicken comes with the wing sauce on it, so um, and spicy chicken, so that might be really good. Might have to try that. All right, so over there, we got the arcade section here at Grotto's, and up towards the front of it, there's a bar. Uh, I guess you can order some drinks while you're playing arcade games if you want to. And then up in the front of the restaurant, is the main bar where a lot of college students and such congregate and then out here we have the restaurant area for patrons like ourselves who are coming in for a late night pizza um, grottos keep some very late hours yes yes they certainly do yeah um, as you can see we're the only ones here right now um, at least in the dining area and um, the server didn't seem too happy to have to serve us, probably because he's not a typical server, but, you know, that's okay. I mean, it's understandable. He sent, sent his servers home for the night. People usually don't come in this late, so, but, um, you know, we do, so we wanted to check it out. And then they got a whole section in the back there, too, that seems to be closed off, and I, I guess maybe they use that for larger parties and such. So here we are over in the arcade section. And you can see some of the games they got. They got a claw machine. They have this game that's called the Amazing Road Trip. It looks like you can win prizes and such. And of course, they got the basketball shootout and another claw machine. All right, so the pizza has arrived. The buffalo chicken pizza from Grotto's. And I gotta say, I can see the steam coming off it. I can see a lot of sauce a lot of cheese, and uh, it's looking slightly amazing. What do you think? It is, and it smells amazing too. If you could just smell it through the camera, um, you'd see what I mean. I'm, I'm looking very forward to diving into this. It seems to smell like wings and pizza, yeah. like a combination of chicken wings and pizza, which is uh, two of my favorite entrees, I would say and uh, to combine them both into one sounds like quite an amazing idea and it's it's not the first time I've heard of this being done but um, we're about to sample this pizza here and let you know all about it mm. there you go you got oh man look at that sauce and chicken yes big chunks of chicken yep lots of cheese yep. lots of cheese it's it's actually really good the sauce the wing sauce makes a big difference because it's got to be just the right kind of wing sauce to go on a pizza and make it good and this has that kind of vinegary spicy flavor to it so it's perfect all right so i'm going to go ahead and sample this legendary taste now, i've had this before uh, grotto's is fairly well known throughout delaware uh, especially in the beach areas of Rehoboth um, and here in Newark it's a popular college hangout so I'm really looking forward to trying this now, I do have to say this is a very very good buffalo sauce Yes. Um, it tastes just as good as any buffalo sauce you would get at a um, popular chicken wing restaurant. Right. Uh, perhaps Buffalo Wild Wings or Wings to Go. Um, it's got a very, very good flavor to it. And it's hard for me to describe because it's kind of a combination flavor between buffalo sauce and cheese. Um, so I can't really say what the buffalo sauce tastes like alone, but um, it's a very, very good um, I'd say slightly vinegary, mm -hmm, slightly yeah. bold, um, yes. just a very good combination. It's the kind that really makes your nose tingle when you smell it. 
You know what I mean? Like yes. you smell this sauce and you think, oh man, there's some buffalo chicken wings. I think there's a lot um, of vinegar in it. Yeah. Yeah, very, very good. Yes. All right, so I see this little table marker here. It's yes. got some events or some services that Grotto's may offer. What do, what do they have on there? Um, basically, they have the, as you can see, community pizza night. You can raise money for your organization. Ah, raise money for BAPI. Right, Paranormal right. Research and Investigation. Exactly. Mm, that's not yep. a bad idea. Paranormal Night at Grotto's. Right. They also have birthday parties. You can bring your kids here if you want to have a little per birthday package. Foods, pizza, you know, unlimited soft drinks. You could have the fundraiser at the same time and raise the money for the birthday party. <laughs> I don't think they'd allow that. My personal favorite, warm brownie sundae. Oh, so they're yeah. advertising some of their desserts on here. That's much better than the cold brownie sundae. Yes. Unless, yeah. And if you do want something cold, grotto gelato, which I kind of like the way that it it rhymes it there. Does you rhyme. Know, it's got it does little, rhyme. Yeah. For those of you who don't know, the gelato <laughs> is, is an Italian ice cream. Um, pretty good stuff. I also really love the crust uh, on the grotto's piece. And as you can see, I'm going to tear into it here. It's very doughy in the center. And uh, it's nice and crispy on the outside. Um, just the right texture. Just the right flavor. All right, so on the way out, of course, we stop at the city of Newark ticket payer thing and pay the parking ticket, which isn't like an illegal parking ticket. It's just a ticket that we got to park in the lot. Right, right. So we just came out of Grotto's Pizza and I have to say I was really impressed. The buffalo chicken pizza that we got was the first time I've ever tried anything like that and um, it, it was just very, very good, very delicious. Um, the manager told us on the way out that he uses white cheddar on the pizzas instead of using mozzarella, which um, kind of, uh, now I understand the flavors that I was tasting there because the cheese was definitely a little more bold, a little more flavor flavorful than the mozzarella would have been. So overall, just a very good experience. I do like Grotto's. Uh, it's a very unique, um, atmosphere if you will they have the bar in the front which gets a lot of attention uh, when the college students are here during the school year it's very packed in there there's usually standing room only and it's also very unique because they have an arcade in there um, they have the pizza restaurant side and they have like I said the bar in the front they also have when you come in the front door they have a little takeout counter too where you can go up and you can order pizza to go um, which is really interesting uh, we are you do have to pay to park here. Um, one thing is on the back, it says, please lock your vehicle. We're not responsible for loss, damage, etc." Now I can see, like in a regular parking lot, right? Like you can expect maybe people breaking your car. But if I'm paying to park there, they should be responsible for the car.